Corey Johnson, front of house engineer for I Killed the Prom Queen. Uh, we've been on tour for about three weeks now. Uh, last night we were in Glasgow, tonight we're in Birmingham, uh, England. I'm touring the M32R at front of house and we have the uh, M32C for monitors, which I have here on my MacBook. And we have a DL32 that for stage box that we're linking both consoles too, so we're doing a gain split between the two consoles. The main reasons for this tour, I chose M32R as the footprint. It's a perfect size for the clubs we're playing on this tour, doing like 500 to 700 cap clubs. Um, and then obviously for the M32C, it's one rack space for the monitor console. And then the stage box, the DL32, is another three racks, so four racks total. And we can fly anywhere in the world with it in one road case. Chess! I've been using the um, M32 Mix Edit software, which gives me, it's full control, you know, it's just like having a console, but it's in my MacBook. So like during rehearsals, I, I come in and I set, set all my gains, set my EQs, you know, and then from there, basically, the band has full control via iPad. We can set a LAN network, and they can, you know, have their faders and everything's labeled out on their iPad, and they can just come in and mix up their, their ears as they go. I just started using the Waves designer on this tour, you know, the built-in effects on this for my snare top to give it a little bit more attack and um, just a little bit more energy. I tried it on snare top and it sounds amazing, so I think I'm gonna start doing it on snare top and kick in and maybe toms as well just for that extra attack and sustain that you can't really get just straight using EQ. So this tour I've started multi-track recording the set so I have all 19 inputs recording simultaneously into my DAW. There's a feature on the M32 where you can send a card out and so I send my multi-track back into my console. I have all 19 channels separately showing up on my console and I can I can do a sound check, you know, instead of coming in and just tuning the PA with a iPod my iPod or something, a track that I know, I can actually have all my inputs. And I can come in and you know start with the kick drum and see what see what it's gonna sound like straight away um, before the band gets on stage and then obviously I I sound check the band as well for the in ears and everything but it kinda just gives me a head start and you know after the tour I can because some of the guys in the band are into recording and stuff, so I can I can give them the tracks as well to do a mix down. So it's another cool feature that I'm using on this tour. It's honestly my favorite as far as uh, sound goes. Preamps sound amazing in the DL32, and the layout of the console, I love it. Everything is straightforward. All my controls are here, everything's on the same layer on the top. Super easy to work with, it sounds amazing. So, super happy with the setup so far. This is Corey Johnson, front house engineer for I Kill the Prom Queen, out on our headlining tour in Europe. Yeah, come down and check us out, thanks.